Hey everybody, I just wanted to touch base and talk to you a little bit about why I made my Latin workbooks in the first place. So I get that question a lot, so I figured I would just make a quick video and explain my thinking behind what I did. So when my first son was in Challenge A, he used this book and I know his handwriting isn't the best, but he really struggled fitting everything in the space provided. So you can see he's kind of, you know, cramming things in here and like, let's see, this one right here. This was nuts. So you can tell he's like, I mean, like, really? So, and this made it really hard to do corrections. So, so what I did instead of that is I just went to a spiral notebook. I just like to keep things simple. So this is my second son. And he's in Challenge B right now, and this is his his book. So he uses the workbook that I made for declining, conjugating, and just copy work to practice all the vocabulary. But this book allows us to make corrections, and if, like, for example, here he made a bunch of mistakes, I made him do some more to try to, you know, hone in that particular skill. I am able to write myself notes if we worked on something verbally. Sometimes I will create these little worksheets. I'll just type up a reading because I want him to practice labeling or have space for the translation and we'll just we'll just tape it in. Then sometimes he will like sometimes we just do it out loud. He doesn't actually write it down, but that way I have record of what we did. There are, um, he'll, he just goes from, he just turns to the next page. We don't divide it up into sections. We just turn the page and do the next thing. Like, for example, here he has some notes from class. So his Challenge B director went over something and he took notes. He was able to just put it right here in his notebook. So having the double space, and again, I know it's messy, but he is learning, so... Um, having the double space allows us to do corrections. Uh, here's another worksheet. I believe I was focusing on him identifying those compound verbs. So anyway, I really like this. I think it's simpler. It's easier for him to keep up. And anyway, we just turn the page. So there you have it. I hope you all have a great day.